Station of a different kind on their way to school, and they're blaming it on a small motel right across the street. Since the 80s, Classic Motel has been open for business along 8th Street in Oak Cliff, right next to Townview High School and Northwest Harley Elementary School. Our Shelly Slater is there live with more on the push to get it shut down. Shelly? Yeah, I mean, it really all comes down to permit problems here. City activists will use that in order to legally fight this motel and shut it down. They say the drugs and the prostitution on this side of the street simply don't match with the students and teachers just right across the way. It's another day in class, but parents worry the lessons learned are here on the streets. Because she sees some things that I don't even see. Virginia Billingsley escorts her daughter to school to keep her out of trouble. I see that it's a lot of prostituting, a lot of uh, women walking the streets, they have their panties off. Between that and the motel lacking the right permits to operate, Dallas Progress wants to shut them down. Sir, this isn't the right permit. What about drugs? I mean, drugs and prostitution in here? None. But complaints from Townview High School show otherwise. But she's had complaints from students, parents, and volunteers when they see prostitutes standing out on the corners, hanging out in front of the school, flagging people down. But owner Yogi Gandhi calls this a family place. It's nothing. We have a family here. I'm not stay myself. We have a family here. My two sons, my wife, me. They should be able to clean it up, but they don't. They let this here kind of stuff go on all the time. Like arrests for prostitution and theft in the last two years, and offenses for aggravated robbery, kidnapping, and burglary. Prostitution, drug dealing, soliciting, exactly why Dallas Progress is shutting these places down. And if it's a success yet again, it'll be their third. The American Inn and Interstate Hotel went through the same permit problems this year, and now they're closed. As for the Classic Motel? They should be shut down today. But they are not shut down today. As you can see, that office is still open. You can see the light. And in fact, the motel is not breaking any laws as of today. They were grandfathered in before these new permit laws ever went into effect. So it's not until now, according to the city attorney's office, that they will have to comply or either get out. Shelly Slater, live in Dallas for Channel 8 News.